Today we're gonna be making street dogs on the Blackstone. Let's get this thing started. Bro! Organic hot dogs from Trader Joe's, turkey bacon, and of course, regular bacon. Some black pepper for those onions. Onion, a couple bell peppers, and then you gotta have some jalapenos up in there too. Get chopping. Cut them thinly sliced. Bam! Gotta cut them thin. It's gotta be thin. You don't want some big old chunks of onion while you're trying to eat your hot dog. Let's get this one going too. Bell peppers are good too. Cut them thin. Get the stems out. Wait for the jalapenos till the end. Let's get these onions cooking. Remember, thin slice. Okay. Cut them in half and then start chopping them thin. Thin slices. Wanna flatten them out a little bit? Okay, bell peppers are done chopping. All right guys, so now it's time to wrap these hot dogs and I'm gonna go ahead and get these weenies, put them on the side. Yeah, I said weenies. <laughs> so I'm gonna start with the turkey bacon cause these are from my baby. You know, I gotta get those turkey bacon ones first. She does not eat pork, which is perfectly fine with me. It's healthier. Uh, I like the pork, my son likes the pork and that's where it pretty much ends. My daughter doesn't eat bacon. I know, kind of strange. Anyways, we're ready. We wrap these dogs up and now we're going to go ahead and clean this griddle make sure you clean it really well uh, i already chopped up my onions and bell peppers as you saw make sure you cut them very very thin all right and let's splash some oil on there and start putting our dogs on the blackstone have you guys considered buying one of these honestly uh they're great they're super convenient you can just throw all your hot dogs in one place it's ginormous i do have a review on this uh blackstone so just so you know you can check that out let's put our onions our bell peppers our jalapenos on here these things actually turned out very spicy the jalapenos uh yeah my mother-in-law took a bite my my wife told me they're pretty spicy i didn't end up actually trying them but the hot dogs definitely all right so what you want to do is make sure you have your burners on high full blast on these baby and start cooking up these hot dogs you can cook these simultaneously all right so here i show you i'm just flipping these dogs uh this took about 25 minutes to cook uh you got to make sure that bacon's really really cooked and i picked up this tip this little pro tip black pepper on the onions and on the bell peppers is a must don't put any salt just the black pepper that's all you need bro all right so let's start flipping these dogs these street dogs i mean have you been to crypto and all these other places where they sell hot dogs it's crazy these hot dogs are like nine dollars you can literally make this hot dog for like 50 cents this is why i wanted to make some street dogs i was actually inspired and i went to a king's game so i actually have a king's shirt and went to a king's game i didn't get a hot dog and i didn't get one because i was like you know what i'm done paying that nine dollars anyway let's keep flipping this bell pepper and onion these are pretty much almost done you guys I'm getting ready to assemble these but uh yeah you make sure they just turn brown and they're pretty much ready to eat at this point. You know, I'm just gonna make sure they got that nice sear on there. And here you go, guys. Check it out. Ready to prepare. I'm gonna get a, a bread. Make sure you toast this on both sides. Little oil goes a long way, all right? And you gotta have it toasted because you want that crunch from the bread too, not just from the bacon, you know what I'm saying? So may I hit, go ahead and toast it. And let's go ahead and flip it. Remember, toast both sides. Man, my mouth's watering just right now, just thinking about it. So you want to put the hot dog first, the bacon, onions, bell peppers, and you're ready to go, dude. But first, you want to put that mustard, you want to put that ketchup too, and this is how I had my second hot dog. Enjoy, you guys. So good.